It's always fun to see the cute and fluffy animals in the animal buildings. The 4-H'ers are here to showcase them. We want to welcome Allison, Katrina, and Lucas, and their very cute rabbits. Uh, and you guys are showing these animals. Tell us uh, what it takes to show rabbits here at the State Fair. So it's definitely a lot of work. We all are siblings and we raise a rabbit in our rabbit tree herd. So specifically this rabbit we raised from birth. So it's a lot of work taking care of the mom as well, feeding and watering daily, but then also to prepare for the fair, we have to groom them, make sure that their nails are clipped, that they're brushed, that they get worked with a lot so they're used to people and can sit like this without freaking out on us. They seem yeah. like they're doing so well with a big crowd here and a mm -hmm. lot going on obviously at the fair. What are their names? Could you introduce us to the, yeah. to the rabbits too? <laughs> so this is Expresso, this is a girl. This is Superman, he's a boy, and then down on the end there, that is Nitro, and he's also a boy. And so you guys show tomorrow morning at, what is it, 8, 8.30? 8 a.m. Bright and early. Mm -hmm. How are you feeling about your chances here? Um, I think we're all feeling pretty good. We've put the work in, so I think it's just time to show it and feel confident about what we've done. When you say show it, what does it take to prepare a rabbit to be shown at the fair? So we start out with grooming, always to make sure that their fur is sitting all nice and pretty and that their nails are nice and short so they don't scratch the judges. And then a lot of working with them. To show a rabbit, you have to pose them, so set them up in a specific way for their breed so that they show off their best attributes. And you have to be sure to flip them as well so you can see the undersides of the animal, make sure they're healthy. Some breeds have markings or coloration underneath the animal, so you have to make sure that that can be on display well. Um, just really getting the animals used to being handled by other people, being handled for long periods of time, and being able to show off their best attributes. For anyone at home who's like, they're so cute, I'd like a pet rabbit. What should people know about caring for these animals? Caring for rabbits is definitely an easier pet than, for example, dog or cat, but they still take work. You have to feed them at least once a day, water two to three times a day. They drink as much water as a small dog. So you really need to make sure that they're getting hydration. <laughs> you need to make sure that they're getting enrichment. So us working and flipping with our animals is how they stay engaged. But if you're not working the show, you need to make sure that you're running out with them, playing with them, making sure that they're getting social interaction. We often hear that part of being a 4-H'er is just interacting with other 4-H'ers, yeah. seeing friends. Is that what you guys are experiencing here too? Yes, yeah, State Fair is like a big sleepover for all of us. <laughs> um, we spend a lot of time together. We're walking around the fair, working with our animals together, having a lot of fun. And it's time for us three siblings too to get to really show off our hard work together. Um, yeah, that's such and a special try to get memory. along. Yes, that's <laughs> such important. a special memory to have as a family. Thank you so much for coming on. Thank you guys. And good luck tomorrow.